So we are back at it again with another tutorial video on how to generate a link for an image to use for your HTML for sharing your photos. So you have been in a situation where you passed your project and you're trying to re-download and recheck if everything works fine. But after you opened your website, all or some of the images are not showing. Well that's because when you tried to open the HTML again, the location of the image changed. And so you would have to retype it again with the right location, which is fairly annoying. But we're going to solve your problems today. So okay, first of all, I would like to give credit to Evergreen Tech Tips for making this possible and of course for teaching me the ways on how to do this in the first place. So go give them a subscription. So what we're going to do is we go to Google. And we're going to type in IMGBB or image bb and the first thing that comes up is that, that you click it so i recommend before doing any of this is you should make an account to store pictures in different albums for future uses but for ours right now is for main purpose of html use so we click on start uploading i already did these three but i'm not going to show it so, we're going to make these images into links for the internet and HTML tag use. So, what if I choose hearts.jpg, open it, or just double click. So, you, you have a choice to either put this in an album of your own in public or in HTML, private link. I would advise you to make it only private link usage because, of course, we're going to do this for HTML purpose. And you have a choice to auto delete it after five minutes or days or even weeks or a month. That's the maximum amount. But for me, I would just not auto delete it for future usage. So click on upload. The image is uploading. As you can see, there's other things here. It's embed codes. So you got links, HTML codes, BB codes. So normally, we would click on HTML image. As you can see, the tag is already put for us ready there all we have to do is copy it I'm gonna demonstrate it by using my own HTML so open with notepad so as you can see body background the background image on this is a I use the computer's image or the storage for the computer and of course, as what I said before, that's going to be a bit annoying when you send it to other people. Because, of course, the image is not on their side. So sometimes, it can be fairly annoying in some parts. But, right here, for the image source, we copy-paste it. Though I already put mine right here. This is a image BB code. I'm going to put the link in there. It depends on you if you want to adjust more about it, you know, if more about width or height or borders. It depends on you because that's an add on. So, next is we're going to save it. And this time we're going to open it. As you can see, it's still the same image. But the only difference is, is that I overwrite, or I overwritten, my image that I get from my storage into a link. So you can get it from the internet instead of your own computer. So that's all we have for today. Well, thanks for watching, and stay tuned.